I can't stop playing $11 buy-ins and printing money. And we have a special late night stream. Alan Jackson, perfect timing. Let's get that bounty. Oh. Diamond free roll. Oh, we saved up our run good for this moment. Get out of here, 109s, 215s. We're rolling deep in this $11 PKO final table. Congratulations. Thank you very much. Final six. Day saver. I know I left you under the assumption that I was done with all my tournaments, but dirty little secret, I had one tournament left. And this is it. Didn't think it was worth it to still be streaming. Oh, no. One table and an $11, but here we are. We didn't give up. We didn't punt it off. We did win a few flips. We did win ace-jack versus ace-jack. And now we're going to do some damage and uh, win yet another tournament. Another day, another tournament win. We got our man here. Loose as a goose. Automatic 2.7x opens. Uh, yeah, we'll get him. Oh, we'll get him. Sometimes you can just see these things happening. It's weird. I mean, do they really have raised folds at this stack depth? I mean, they have to be pretty damn nutted here. Uh, especially with all these similar stacks. Look at the stack distribution. Although my gut says to fold, uh, I'm just not going to fold. Not Alan Jackson. Not after 10 hours of a grind. Let's always have it. It's so obvious. Oh, until the jack pops off. What you gonna do when you get jacked on the turn? Got he. <laughs> 51 million chips, not a big deal. Boski, why do you play these $11 binds? Does ACR make you play them? Oh man, they just make me. They make me play them. I can't stop playing $11 buy-ins and printing money. I hate printing money and winning tournaments with little to no risk. Boski sees it as free money. Well, if you go to Shark Scope, type in the Boski advanced search, and you can put the buy-ins between $10 and $12, and you'll see what I've done at the $11 level. Hold. The boat ski running super hot. Tough break, Rodney. You got to get that pay jump. Oh, big pots. Someone's at risk. Bigger bounty survives. We do like to see that. More for us to take. Vanessa Selps told me it's good to raise your gutter balls. Wait, are we open-ended now? Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Um, uh, three, four, five, six, seven. Uh, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, you got you got seventh. Overbet bluff. Wow, what a savage. Uh, decent card to check jam. Oh, we just get there on the river. Not a big deal at all. Milk them for half pot. I uh, find it hard to believe. Oh, wait. I thought I had a straight flush for a second. I uh, find it hard to believe that they'd backdoor a flush on us. More likely they have a hand like... Uh, It doesn't matter, we have a flush. We're just going to call. Wow, it doesn't bet the turn with the pair and the flush draw. Max Payne. Three, check, fold. Okay, you, you redeemed 
a shark scope berate. So <clears throat> let's see what we can do here. Yeah, it's pretty, you're not giving me much to work with here. Three check fold, but I'll see what I can do for you. Uh, okay. Uh, I have ace high. It's a pretty good hand. Just max values ace 10. Glad that worked out for him. All right, so shark scope, three check fold. Do, 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 do. Not much volume, but as you can see, it's a flat line for the first 70 games. He's playing free rolls, ladies and gentlemen. And then a small miracle happens and he wins up $200. Second place in a six max PKO. So he's got a roll. He's gonna gamble with said roll. And gamble he does. A few shots go right, a few shots go wrong. He's still up a buck fifty. Yeah, this isn't exactly a smooth graph. I don't know what the hell happened here. Is that was that a flash flash crash? Is that what they call it in the stock market? A flash crash? Down downward trend, downward trend, and then boop! A Christmas miracle happens and he gets a $400 win. Fourth in a PKO. Ooh, oh, I know that one. I know that PKO. Good job. Congrats. Cash out and head for the hills. Bust your nuts. Count all that profit. Menudo TV with Menudo TV with the raid. Menudo TV. Thank you very much. Uh, all right. Ace high should be good here. Just has sixes. 1.6 million to go. All right, here we go. Big spot. We're coming in with that warm four bet. We have a pair and fold equity. He could easily be doing this with ace three offsuit or something. Got him. Big double. The cooler. King Queen. Okay. We have a good hand. Let's eliminate him and win heads up. King me. No. Fucking flips. Got to win your flips. A small setback. Now he's really going to be gunning for my bounty if he's smart. So, perfect time for us to rep tilt and to get a loose call. Get that double. Be right back to where we were. Easy game. Alan Jackson always here for us. Now we just take it down. Easy jam. Okay, get there. 10 for the sweat. 10 on the river. We got him. Immediate $330 pay jump with the bounties. We're heads up for all the money. Let's get it. I gotta time you out. You can't say good luck. Clearly indicates that we're heads up. Oh, we got a pair. What are the odds he has a diamond? Let's see, there's four diamonds out there. 13 diamonds in the deck. Nine diamonds left, divided by two cards in his hand. All right, not too many ace-x. He shouldn't be bluffing with ace-x. So we definitely have a bluff catcher. Question is, what hands is he gonna bluff with? And I think we're good. Should be a little juicer. Jack Dewey, new chip leader in town. Okay. Okay. 
Yeah, don't play slots. Don't gamble. Come on. That, like he says, that is a good commercial where he says, you will lose. I am down millions. It's a wet board. We got a bluff catcher. A6, no good. Menudo is a soap? Soup. Oh. No. The Ricky Martin, he was in a band called Menudo. 100%. Might be soup too, I don't know. But, let's keep it a buck 50. Unless we're in an alternate reality, Ricky Martin was in Menudo. All right, what are we gonna beat? We're gonna beat King, King Four. We're gonna beat King Four. King Three. <laughs> King Three. What are the odds? Well, I mean, people people deny that this is a sim. I mean, there's clearly glitches. Clearly glitches. Uh, pretty wet board. Top pair. Top pair hard to come by. Yeah, we check raise go with this. Uh, we could get some spews from it as well. Uh, Jamming is also an option, but we will take it down. Give him a little teaser. Hopefully we beat him before the five minute delay comes up. First time I've limped. Does not respect the limp. Uh, we can float. Got some back doors. Small bet. And we are going to have a lot of 9x in our limp calling range. Uh, that's a better card for him. Mm, could have some just pure trash, but this would be too much of a hero call. I mean, when you cross the border to where he could be like bluffing with queen five or something, things can go horribly wrong. But he does love bluffing. Oh, not this time. Blinds are up. One mil, two mil. Nice and easy. Don't need the big blind help when it's one mil, two mil. Same as one, two blinds. Like your local cash game. Mm, she's a good teaser. The overbet. Um, I just don't think he's going to have many aces here. I think he's going to have a lot of straight draws and flush draws. Specifically straight draws. So we're going to call and probably call safe rivers. As crazy as that sounds. Pretty safe river. Unless he picked up some 7-8 bullshit. It just wouldn't make sense for him to overbet an ace on the turn. Uh, he does go for it, and this might be this might be ugly, but we gotta stick with the plan for the win. Nothing. Air ball. We got him. Mm. Victory again. The triple ocho plus the bounties. A game, twelve hours deep. Whew, you gotta know your man. Some people are not capable of bluffing there. I knew he was. Went with the read, lived with the results. And that is poker. A lot of it is a guessing game. But an educated guess is what it's all about. All right, so we won almost $2,000. What, 888 plus all those bounties? Uh, I'll say 1850 $1,815. We were in for $11. Why do you play micros, bro? Why do you play micros, bro? I think it's pretty obvious. The thrill of the victory and less agony of defeat. The pros outweigh the cons. You too can play micros on America's card room. If you don't have an account, sign up today. Promo code BOSKI. Thanks for watching. We'll be back soon. Like, follow, subscribe, etc. Sign up on Raise Your Edge. Take your game to the next level. I learned a lot of things from them. You can too. Use my promo codes. 
and we're out.